Manila, Philippines. The Philippine Air Force is on the verge of a significant enhancement in its maritime surveillance capabilities with the imminent arrival of its first long-range patrol aircraft. This development comes as part of a $114 million contract awarded to Israel's Elbit Systems, aiming to bolster the country's defense posture amid escalating tensions in the South China Sea. According to Israel's ambassador to the Philippines, Alan Flus, the initial delivery of the ATR-72600 based aircraft is expected by mid-2025. This timeline aligns with the contract stipulations, signaling a pivotal step in the Philippine Air Force's modernization efforts. The long-range patrol aircraft will be outfitted with an advanced mission suite including a mission management system, electro-optics, radar, signals intelligence, and communication systems. These enhancements are designed to provide the Philippine Air Force with a comprehensive surveillance platform capable of extended operations over the country's vast maritime territories. The acquisition of these aircraft addresses a long-standing gap in the Philippine Air Force's capabilities, which have historically relied on aging platforms for maritime patrol missions. The introduction of the ATR-72-600 long-range patrol aircraft is anticipated to significantly improve the Philippines' ability to monitor and secure its maritime borders. This procurement is part of the broader armed forces of the Philippines' modernization program, specifically under Horizon 1, which has faced various delays since its inception in 2013. The successful delivery and integration of the long-range patrol aircraft signify renewed momentum in the country's defense modernization initiatives. Elbit Systems' involvement in this project underscores the growing defense collaboration between the Philippines and Israel. The Israeli firm has previously supplied the AFP with various defense equipment, including unmanned aerial systems and land-based platforms, further solidifying the bilateral defense relationship. As the Philippine Air Force prepares to integrate the long-range patrol aircraft into its fleet, this development marks a significant stride towards enhancing the country's maritime domain awareness and overall defense capabilities. The Philippine archipelago, composed of more than 7,000 islands, spans an enormous maritime area that includes territorial waters, exclusive economic zones, and strategic choke points such as the West Philippine Sea and the sulu Celebes Sea Triangle. Despite the geopolitical importance of these waters, the AFP has historically lacked a dedicated, long-endurance platform for maritime patrol. The arrival of the long-range patrol aircraft is a direct response to these deficiencies. According to Israeli Ambassador Elon Fluss, the aircraft will be equipped with an advanced suite of mission systems, including electro-optical-slash-infrared sensors, maritime surveillance radar, signals intelligence modules, and secure communication equipment. Once fully operational, the long-range patrol aircraft will be capable of persistent monitoring of maritime traffic, detecting and tracking unauthorized vessels, and providing real-time intelligence to decision makers. This capability is especially critical in contested regions like the South China Sea, where illegal fishing, incursions by foreign ships, and natural disasters demand a rapid and informed response. Beyond its maritime surveillance function, the long-range patrol aircraft could serve multiple strategic roles. Its integrated mission systems will allow it to act as a force multiplier for both military and civilian agencies. For instance, the aircraft can assist in environmental monitoring, counter-smuggling operations, disaster response coordination, and even anti-piracy missions. Moreover, the ISR, Intelligence, Surveillance, Reconnaissance capability of the long-range patrol aircraft, could prove essential in enhancing situational awareness across the archipelago. In recent years, the Philippines has encountered increased pressure in the West Philippine Sea due to the activities of foreign fishing fleets, Coast Guard vessels, and maritime militia groups. With a modern long-range patrol aircraft in its arsenal, the PAF will be better positioned to monitor these developments and coordinate a calibrated response. The involvement of Elbeat Systems underscores the deepening defense relationship between the Philippines and Israel. Known for its technological innovations and successful partnerships worldwide, Elbit brings extensive experience in converting civilian aircraft into advanced military platforms. In recent years, Elbit has supplied a variety of defense equipment to the AFP, including artillery systems, night vision gear, 
unmanned aerial vehicles UAVs, and battlefield management systems. The ATR-72-600 long-range patrol aircraft conversion represents the firm's first major engagement with the Philippine Air Force in the aviation domain, and its success could pave the way for additional collaborations in the future. The modification work is also being partially conducted within Philippine territory. This inclusion of local facilities and technical personnel offers a dual benefit, reducing overall logistical costs and fostering local expertise in systems integration, testing, and support. While the Philippines is still years away from developing indigenous military aviation platforms, participation in these types of projects strengthens its fledgling defense industrial base. The long-range patrol aircraft acquisition is one of the final unfinished projects from Horizon 1 of the AFP Modernization Program, which ran from 2013 to 2017. Horizon 1 was intended to cover foundational defense systems, but many of its goals were delayed or sidelined due to funding constraints, procurement bureaucracy, and leadership transitions.